not to go outside till you've finished your homework. Sorry, Nana, I forgot. And please, don't go in the woods by yourself. Was it by myself? I can't do this. Do what? Ugh, math. It's not my strong suit either. Want to take a break? Okay. PBJ sound good? No, Christy can't have peanuts. Who? Christy. It's peanuts, right? Yeah, she can't have peanuts. <sighs> well, I was making tuna for myself. How about tuna for you two? That's our favorite. All right. I'm gonna go finish folding laundry. Okay. Allison, turn off the TV. It's time to finish your homework. I'm not supposed to, but can I use a calculator? All right. Just this once. Thanks, Nana. Allison, did you take the knife? No, what knife? You know you're not supposed to have knives. I wasn't. I don't even know what you're talking about. It's around here somewhere. I'll find it. There you are, Christy. I'm just finishing the last problem, then we can go outside again. No, she wasn't yelling at me. She just making sure I got my homework done. No, it's my homework, Nana. I'm going to go play outside. All right.
Oh, hi, Minnie. Hello. I, uh, I stopped by to offer my condolences. I, uh, made you lasagna. Oh, gee, thanks, Arthur. That's really thoughtful of you. Yeah, you just pop it in the oven for 370 degrees for 10 minutes. Okay. Well, Ellie will be really happy to have something besides frozen pizza for once. Well, little Allison, I bet she's really grown by now. Yeah. Well, she's quite a handful for an old lady like me. Hmm. It's really a shame what happened to her mother. Well, you know, Art, she's, she's pretty strong. She's... Seems to be spending a lot of time with her friend, Christy. She's got quite an imagination. Christy? As in Christy Jenkins? No, that certainly wouldn't be good now, would it? I'm sorry, who? Christy Jenkins had it rough. She endured the pain, but had enough. Her dad took a swing, she tried to fight back. In the woods she lies after a fatal whack. Arthur, that's, that's just a ghost story for kids. Oh, rumor has it Christy was killed in these woods right here by her own father. Arthur, that's horrible. <sighs> Poor little girl. I mean, quite an unfortunate circumstance. Let's just hope that it's not who Allison's been hanging out with. Yeah. Well, thanks for the lasagna, Arthur. We'll see you soon. Bye. It was a pleasure. Bye. Bye. Bye-bye. Better not be in the woods. Allison! Allison Marie Johnson! Where are you? <laughs> oh! Allison, don't scare me like that. What are you doing out here? I, I told you not to be out in the woods alone. I was playing hide and seek with Christy. Well, no more in the woods ever. And tell Christy it's time for dinner and you can talk to her tomorrow. Come on. Remember Mr. Thompson? The man who talks to himself? So, are we feeling pepperoni or cheese tonight? All we ever eat is pizza. Listen, I'm sorry. I haven't really had a lot of energy to cook lately. I like the way my mom cooked better anyways. Allison, that's not really a nice thing to say. It's the truth. All right, then how about lasagna? Mr. Thompson made it for us. I'd rather be dead. Oh my God, Allie. Allie, Allie, I'm sorry. Allie, I'm so sorry. Allie, we can have whatever you want to eat tonight. Can we have Chinese food? My mom never let me have that. Yes. We can have Chinese, whatever you want, honey. Ellie, I'm 
really sorry about what happened before. Me too. I just miss Mommy. I know. I miss her too. Hang on a minute. I have something. No, I'm sure Nana likes you. This is only our first play date. Trust me, she's the best grandma ever. She's nervous about the woods because I just moved here. It'll get better. You'll see. I found this picture. I thought you might like to have it. You know, you can have anybody from school come over and play with you. We can carve pumpkins. Even when, when your mama's grown up, she liked to do that. The kids at school don't really like me. Oh, honey. What are you talking about? Maybe they're just shy. Do you want, do you want me to call somebody? <laughs> no, that's okay. Can Christy carve one with us, though? I don't think she's ever done that before. She's gonna have to ask her parents. She doesn't really have any, like me. I know. Honey, I'm doing my best. But things are different now.
thank goodness. I found you when I did. I was worried we lost you. Good thing I had that spare key on me. You would have been a goner. Good thing I noticed you keep your spare key underneath the rock. I bet you keep that there for Allison to get in the house when you're not home. Allison? Allison? No. You know, she's always welcome at my house. Since it's just me and that big house, there's more than enough room for little Allison. Allison? Allison, I'm coming! It's just temporary, Allison. And we're gonna be right down the street. If you forget anything, we can always pop right back over and get it. Oh, come on. I don't bite. 